Welcome to Enchanted Tarot. This is for the sign of Aries. It is a general reading. That being said, it may or may not resonate with you. If it doesn't sound like it's your story, check your other placements. Your messages could be there. So Aries, at the heart of your reading, you have the heart, you have the book, and you do have the dragon. And so the heart is, speaks to something, um, the pace of the energy of that symbol speaks to something that's steady what i feel is something there's a relationship that is steady uh on your mind okay um i feel like uh you have a lot of unanswered questions about this relationship with the book following it uh answers that are hidden from you currently but that you would really like to have um, you could be questioning the potential of this relationship and I feel it is the potential to overcome difficulties that you are having in this relationship. Um, I feel like it, it's almost like you have to make a choice whether uh, to stick with this relationship and try to uh, fix you know, that which has been broken um, or to walk away from it because uh, clearly there's a decision here uh, that you've been putting off because it's just too emotional when you think about it because, because, because like there's just so many reasons why you're not making that decision, you know, uh, to to walk away from this person who's uh, hot and cold and hot and cold um, who uh, possibly uh, can also be uh, very sharp with their words um, <clears throat> it's it's it feels like the relationship has been slipping or dying but uh, you you are in love with this person I mean you can give any reason why, any other reason why, you know, I'm not ending it because I'm afraid or because of this or because of that. But really at the root, you're not ending it because you still love the person. That is why you're not ending it. And as long as you uh, have these feelings of love for this person, I feel you're going to stay in it and try to get the answers and and try to uh to fix this the dragon is here really it, it, it's a helper to you i mean the dragon is strength it's having the resolve to do something um to follow through with something to overcome something or to complete or even to change something um it brings you strength and a renewed sense of purpose. This dragon's appearance in your reading is very, very good, okay? Because this dragon is going to show you the next step that you should take, and it will give you the power to take it. So, it tells you, watch for a sign. Okay, so... We'll just set that over here for now. Let's go deeper. We have the tree, and this is about uh, wisdom. It is also about uh, the growth or stages of growth of something. This can be something that's been uh, going on for a long period of time. Um, this could be uh, you could have been together for some time. Um, it could be that you've been trying to transform this relationship for some time. It feels like there is a lot of grief. It feels like it's not moving. Uh, the Empress is in the reverse. So whatever you've been attempting to heal or to change um it's like it's like i feel like a an exhaustion sometimes 
Uh, but it feels like it's not growing and sometimes you just want to give up on it. And so sometimes you find yourself thinking, you know, uh, do I continue or not? Especially when you're in that down moment. But um, I don't believe you will walk away from this. Um, you have a lot of uh, fears uh, about the this idea you have of um, of trying to uh, fix the relationship or get to the root issue of what is going on with your partner, what happened to this relationship, and how can we fix it? Um, I, I feel like um, just thinking of uh of leaving uh it's almost like you know maybe even you know like sometimes oh my god i should leave i should leave i should leave but you can't do it just the thought of it hurts this uh relationship uh is not over in and for you it's not over you're resisting this ending and you're i i kind of feel like you're just not going to give up you don't want to give up i mean your heart doesn't want you to give up on this so this is like uh this is like um it's like, you know, wanting to do anything uh, to make it work or to change, uh, to change something uh, in that relationship that needs to go or to change, uh, to change that, even to chase away those thoughts, uh, to change those thoughts of, oh my God, it's not going to work, it's not going to work, because sometimes that's that's how the mind is going to go, you know. Uh, because uh, it's exhausting. You, there's a need to be very, very careful here with the praying mantis. The snail tells me that uh, something is really taking time. You really need to be patient. So it's going really, really slow. Um, there's been a lot of fighting, a lot of arguing. Uh, and, and again, in those moments, you would feel like uh, walking away, but you can't bring yourself to do that more than likely. I mean, the heart is still involved here. As long as the heart is involved, as long as the heart still wants this, you're in it, you know. You're in it. For better or for worse. Trickery. This is a card of a... Um, you're trying to shed light on something because something maybe doesn't feel right. It feels like uh, you're trying to find that missing piece. Maybe your person keeps acting mysteriously. Maybe one minute they say they want it and then the next minute it looks like they're, they've gone cold and you don't know why. Or there's a sudden change in their behavior. Uh, that makes you question the relationship once again and them and their feelings and uh, their promises or whatever it is they're telling you. This is a situation that feels most likely very fragile, especially if there's been a lot of conflict and anger and, and flaring up um, nerves being very frayed you know feeling on edge feeling sometimes like you got to walk on eggshells with that praying mantis or it's like it, it it you know i yes this relationship 
is having problems and struggles and it's been struggling for a while but at the root of it all you're not ready to give up on this relationship um i feel like you're in it you know uh in it to win it in it uh for the long haul uh eight of cups you you um uh, see there eight of cups here is this is where um you're thinking of taking a direction uh to walk away but you can't you're already grieving before you even it just thinking of it causes you grief and so this is you wanting back in a relationship wanting to make it work wanting to to proceed forward uh with this plan um to be able to set yourself free from uh these anxieties um uh, to get to the root issue, uh, to get back what you lost, you know, because at one time you had this and you had this and you had this, you know, at one time, this was a very, very happy couple, a happy family. And that is what you're determined to get back. A new beginning with the child. Um, this is could be the early stages of something that the dragon will show you. Okay, so uh, the early stages, uh, the stages uh, of the relationship. So this could be the early stages of something new, some uh, new thought, new idea. Uh, something that brings hope and maybe I feel like it's all connected to the dragon. There's the owls and they lend you their eyes to see through the dark as does the dragon. It's all part of the same energy. And then uh, the time. When the time is right, um, clearly for you to walk away, this is not the time. Um, uh, clearly, uh, there will be light that will be shed. When the time is right, there's a timer here. Uh, there's a candle here. There's the owl, and the owl is here. Uh, when the time, there's a, a specific time that an event occurs... Uh, and it could have to do with that person, the other person getting a wake-up call. Or this could be a, an illumination uh, for you on which path to take with the dragon. Because the dragon is telling you, watch for a sign. I'm going to show you the way. I'm going to make the next step very clear. And I'm going to give you the power to take it. And look how your reading ends. This is what you had, and this is what you're going after. And so I feel like some way, some way is going to open up for you to be able to find a way to save this. That's what I'm getting. There's an event in the very near future that will show you or be a sign that will bring hope that will show you and guide you as to the correct decision and i i think that you already know it but there's something here that it will happen um there's something here that will happen that you need to take a decision upon um that uh that will help you okay so there's something that will happen or be shown to you that helps you to overcome this challenge because this is a challenge that brings back the hope 
and a renewed sense of purpose, I almost feel like something happens to the other person. Something w happens to the other person and it kind of, uh, something, it's like they're going to get a wake-up call. And that wake-up call brings, it directly affects you, so it brings you hope. So possibly something that they are going to tell you. that brings hope that you can indeed proceed to the greater goal of, you know, of overcoming the difficulties that you've been having. And you've been having these difficulties with this person for quite some time too. So, the answer that you wish to know, the book also tells you about the relationship. The book is also telling you will soon be revealed to you. Again, this is all connected to that dragon. I mean, they may do something or say something that really shows that, okay, they really do love me. And maybe that gives you that uh, renewed sense of purpose to continue. It's not going to fix itself overnight, but there's something here that that is a driving force behind you uh, m continuing to move forward with this. Something is opening up and will light the way for you. That's what I have for you. <laughs> I thank you for watching, for liking, and for sharing uh, my videos and for subscribing. Also, thank you to everyone who has sent in a donation. It is greatly appreciated. Many blessings to all of you.